loitering in the lobby? I'm not loitering. Can we help you with that? This is my business, man. This isn't considered loitering. I said I do not consent to be on a camera. Oh, we're in a public setting, ma'am. I don't have any two cent stamps. He just gave me a two cent stamp. I don't have any. Are you refusing service? What do you want to do with a two cent stamp? Um, that's that would be my business. That would be your business. I'm gonna ask you to leave the no. lobby. So now you have a memo here and rules and regulations on federal property stating I could do this. Doesn't even have a name badge on. Is that your concern? It is my concern. Uh, yeah. Well, it looks like it looks like crap on your end. He lied. So we'll be filing a complaint on him. I know. There you go. What's going on, everyone? This is Press NH Now over here today in St. Johnsbury, Vermont, at the United States Post Office. Today we're going to be conducting a First Amendment audit to see if they respect our rights to film here in public. Today's date is April 11th, 2022. Please make sure you go like, share, and subscribe to my channel at Press NH Now. I appreciate all of your support. Also, check out my playlist to see some videos you might not have seen in the past. Hit that like button, let all your friends and family know about my activism in and around the New England states. Always check your description, all links will be included. Donations are greatly appreciated. They do help me continue my activism in and around the New England area. We're going to go inside here soon, look at Poster 7, get a stamp, and uh, enjoy the video. All right, we'll go inside, get a stamp, look at Poster 7. Looking for poster seven. There it is. Five and sixteen, poster seven. Photographs for news advertising and commercial purposes. Yeah, in a sec. So Valentine's Day stuff. Huh. Easter. Just Linden? Lindenville, not Linden. Okay, specifically that one. Okay. Alright, I'll try there. Is there parking in the back? 
for customers or? Uh, there is, but not a lot. There's not a lot of parking? Yeah. Okay. Because, you know, we, the um, employees kind of fill it up, but there, oh, is really? some, there is some parking. Okay, so you allow customer parking no background? Yeah. Okay. I'm not as of yet. No, I was just asking him a quick question. Right, so we can have you loitering in the lobby. I'm not loitering. Can we help you with something? This is my business, man. This isn't considered loitering. So can we help you with something here, though? No, I didn't ask you for okay. anything. So it is a privacy thing when we have people up here with their credit cards. Then you should probably tell them to keep it private. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to leave the no. lobby. Okay, so no, I'll you have a memo here and rules and regulations on federal property stating I could do this. Okay. So you should probably follow your rules as, a, so as, as I am. Okay, that's fine. Okay, well, guess what? I'll be right back in after I'm done. Are you trespassing me or? Is that what she's doing? I mean, I kind of need to know. I don't know. If I'm being trespassed, then, you know, I'll leave. But this is my business, and she needs to understand that. What is your business? To record inside of this post office, oh. as your rules say that I can. Okay. Is she the postmaster? Or? She's the supervisor. Oh, yeah? Yeah. They don't know very much. I am actually going to get a stamp. I'm actually going to get a stamp also. Okay. Um, do you have any? Yeah, you have penny stamps or? Uh, yeah, we do. Awesome. So, I'll take a penny stamp. Loitering would be considered having a place, uh, place of no business. So we'll scratch that right off the list with this transaction. Oh, yeah. I have a two cent stamp. Two cent? I need a one cent, man. They're usually the lamps. Yeah, I usually I do have one, but for some reason. Oops. You guys have name tags there? Uh, yeah, I do. You mind putting it on? It's on my sweater in, in my locker. Right yeah. Now. I think that's in your guys' policy to have a name tag on. Actually, I don't, I don't have a one cent stamp. I have a two cent stamp. You have a two cent stamp. Okay, I'll take a two cent stamp. That'll be the first. What is your name, by the way? Rick. Rick. Awesome, Rick. Nice to meet you. You're more pleasant than the supervisor. You wouldn't think that she was the one to supervise you, you know? He knows better, more about the rules than you do, huh? Oh, is that right? Yeah, apparently. I don't, I don't know anything about the rules. Yeah, no, you should. They're right on the wall. I'm following them. You should probably follow them, too. He doesn't even have a name badge on. Is that your concern? It is my concern. Yeah. Well, it looks like it looks like crap on your end for not upholding his policy. Is there something I can help you with? No, I'm getting help right now. Okay. What's your name? I don't need to tell you that. No, that's fine. I'll request it. I will. Anything oh, else I can yeah, do? I need a um, receipt also, please. Am I being trespassed there? No name. Here's your receipt, sir. Awesome. You threw it away. You don't want me to do a survey on you? <laughs> you guys always tell people you want to do a survey. Are you yeah, gonna you're right. Circle right. it up, man. Let me know. Okay. Yeah. Surveys right here. All right. Care to take it? Yeah. Thank no, you. of course I will. I um I always do my surveys, especially on the ones who uh, show me professionalism. Is the uh, PD coming? Because I don't want to run away and leave. The postmaster? No, the PD. She said she was calling the PD. I just I don't want to walk away and run away thinking that I'm I leaving a scene. I don't know. Would you be able to ask her? Just so I know. I mean, I won't go anywhere. I'll wait for them. Thank you.
It's funny, there's a detective right here, but he's not coming this way. That the police were called. Is a postmaster here? Um, I, I don't think so. I mean, oh, the supervisor? supervisor's here, but I don't know about the postmaster. Thank you. Uh, he's, he's out. What about that lady? She, you said she was the supervisor? Yeah. Yeah, does she have a business card? No. She doesn't have a business card? No. Okay. Don't know. Um, I actually do need another stamp. Um, he said he couldn't find any penny stamps. I don't have any. You don't have any penny stamps? No. Okay. Can I get a two cent stamp then? Don't have one. You don't have any stamps? Can I help you? Sir, can I get a stamp please? I don't have any two cent stamps. He just gave me a two cent stamp. I don't have any. Are you refusing service? No. I just don't have any. Just hit the red button on the screen. Don't have any. You didn't even look. You just tell me you don't I have any? I just told you. I don't have any. Ma'am, can I help you? Are you serious? I don't want to get involved in all this. Well, no, I need a stamp. He's refusing services now because I have a camera, is pretty sure. Oh. So that's already done. Wow. Here's a stamp. No, no service, huh? This was wrong. Huh. This is how they treat the public here, I guess. Yeah. You said, oh, the best? The best. Oh, you should have been here about 20 minutes ago. Yeah. Best 20 minutes will uh, 20 minutes will change your mind no. in 30 years. No, I don't think so. All right. Well, I'm sorry. I said I do not to be oh, we're in a public setting now. That's a good try, though. Hey, can I get a two cent stamp, please? What do you want to do with a two cent stamp? Um, that's that would be my business. That would be your business. Yeah. So, so he lied. So we'll be filing a complaint on him. him. No. I know. There you go. It's your two cent stamp. Yep. For refusal of service, I'll be contacting the postmaster on that. Awesome. Oops. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'll worry about it. Awesome. Survey, right? Awesome, man. I wonder how many more two cent stamps I can get today. We'll see him next. Go round and round. So it looks like he left him stranded here today and uh, refused business and services for me. So we'll be filing a complaint on that behalf. Wonderful co worker you have, man. Pardon? Wonderful co worker you have leaving you stranded. All right, everyone. Well, that's going to be it over here today at the United States Post Office in St. Johnsbury, Vermont. I appreciate all you tuning in and the continued support that you guys are showing me in my channel. Um, got refused service over here by one of the uh, one of the post office employees. Um, not very professional. Completely lied to me regarding uh, the two cent stamps. So uh, he isn't there for the rest of the day. But either way, um, I'll be filing a complaint with that regarding him and his conduct. And uh, the supervisor not understanding her rules. It's pretty sad that the member of the public like myself has to teach these postal employees, supervisors, and postmasters about their own rules and regulations on postal property. 
Uh, the police did not get called, uh, as far as I know, but I will be trying to pull some records regarding it, um, and we'll find out through a records request. And uh, that's going to be it over here today. I appreciate all your support. Please go like, share, and subscribe to my channel at Press NH Now. Also, check out my playlist to see some videos you might not have seen in the past. Hit that like button. Let all your friends and family know about my activism in and around the New England area. Always check the description. All links will be included. Donations are greatly appreciated. They do help me continue my activism in and around the New England states. That's going to be it over here. Appreciate all your support. See you in the comments. Press NH Now. Over and out.